Okay, so this is Johnny Peppers, and I'm creating a video on how to do grouped sample mean in StatCrunch. Okay, so we see we have a sample of college students was asked how much they spent monthly on cell phone plans approximate the mean for the cost. So we have our grouped data and the number of students. So I am going to click on my icon here right next to my data, which gives me my choices. I want to open in StatCrunch. So StatCrunch opens and then you have all of your data nicely arranged for you. Looks like a little Excel spreadsheet here. And I'll move that out just because I want to be able to see my data. And if I need a sample mean for grouped data with this open in StatCrunch, I'll click on Stat, Summary Stats, Grouped, Bend Data. So I get my options here for my grouped summary stats. My bins are monthly cell phone plan cost. It counts number of students. Now this is very important for a mean. I want to do the midpoints defined by the average of consecutive lower limits. So right here, my monthly cell phone is $10 to $19.99, $20 to $29.99, etc. This gives me my midpoints defined by the average of my lower limits. My midpoint here is 15. If I leave it by the limits, it's going to give me just a slight difference in average because this cannot go to 20 because it can't overlap. <clears throat> so I use consecutive lower limits, click on mean, and compute. I get my monthly cell phone plan cost average of $34.99.99412. They asked me to round to the nearest cent, so that would be $35 even. So I'll go in and I'll say 35.00 and enter, and I get the check mark that I've done it correctly.